I didn't start to even. Start by opening up MPLAB X. Uh, click on Create New Project. Make sure that Microchip Embedded is clicked and Standalone Project is clicked. Uh, from the Families, choose Advanced 8-Bit MS MCU Pick 18. And from the Device, scroll down to 18F452. Click Next. Uh, make sure that the hardware is plugged in and you should see the serial number appear. Uh, click it and press Next. Choose the MPASM for the compiler. Click Next. Um, now you can browse to choose a place where you want to save the file and type in the new file name. and click finish. Um, so now if you want to add a new file to the project, you right click on source files and click ex add existing item. If you saved the test.asm from the web page, you can now select it to be added as a source file and double click to view it. And then you want to build and clean, which is a button right up here at the top. Or you can right click on your project and select clean and build. Uh, if it's successful, then you can click run and run project. If you have a problem with running the MPLAB X IDE, you can run the device switcher as administrator. Now you can click on ID ICD3, click MPLAB X and apply changes. Uh, it could take some time. We've already done it so it doesn't take a lot of time. Uh, it comes up as no error and that the changes are done. So you can click close. Open up MPLAB X again. And when you click clean and build, there should be no error this time.